Hey guys, I'm Nick Fershaw here with uh, Landon Donovan, a face familiar to a lot of our fans uh, with MLSsoccer.com. And Landon, what are we doing in uh, New York this weekend? Uh, this is a cool event for us. I get to hang out with Derek Jeter, Matt Ryan, right. Wayne Gretzky, and a bunch of gamers from all over the world that came to this Gillette EA Sports Champions of Gaming tournament. They all uh, basically competed against each other to get a chance to come here and play against us, so it's a real cool night. Okay, great. Let's talk a little bit about uh, going back to L.A. Um, you guys are off to a red hot start this year. What's been the difference in these first uh, three games? Uh, continuity. We've yeah. got basically the same team that we had last year, which yeah. helps, which for L.A. fans, they know that that hasn't happened for a long time. Uh, we've added three Brazilians, uh, Clint Mathis, who hasn't played yet, and then Mike Stevens, a rookie who's, I think, done really well for us. And We've gotten off to a great start. We haven't actually played all that well. We're still missing right. Burhalter, Eddie Lewis, David Beckham. Only now is Alan Gordon and Jovan Karofsky getting back, yeah. so things look good for us. Can you talk real quick about Edson Buttle and the start that he's had? And uh, a lot of rumors about him sort of now being in the pool for the U.S. national team. I know that's not something that you decide, but can you at least talk about uh, how he's played last three well, weeks? Well, I, I believe that success is no accident. And so people just see him start the season and scoring these goals, and it's like, oh, where did this come from? Right. What people didn't see is that in the off season he was at the Home Depot Center three or four times a week working out, getting himself strong, um, doing little things that good pros do to make sure they're, they're ready to go. And so there's no, it's no surprise to me that he started this well. Um, and I think at this moment uh, he's clearly the best forward in our league right now in this moment, and um, I, I absolutely think he deserves a look for the national team. Has anything else surprised you in the league first couple weeks of the season? Any other teams, any other players that uh, you guys have has caught your eye? Um, you know, I've there's a lot of, actually there's a lot of new players in the league that we don't know a lot about. Obviously the kid Shalosky from New England actually played pretty well against us the first game and did well to score a few goals um, on the weekend. Uh, but it's still early and these things will kind of iron themselves out as the year goes. Uh, one last question for you. You guys have Real Salt Lake this weekend. Uh, that's a big matchup early, sort of, to establish yourself in the Western Conference with those guys. Take us through um, what that matchup means for you guys. Yeah, very big. Um, well, obviously, there's a bitter taste in our mouth from last year, mm -hmm. the way it ended. Um, for me, Salt Lake plays the best soccer in the league, and uh, they're always difficult to play against, especially on our big field. They do a good yeah. job of spreading you out and passing the ball, so it's going to be a difficult game, but we realize even at this early point in the season, if we beat them, uh, I think we'd be nine, eight points up on them, right. which at this point of the year would be really big, so it's a big game for us. Great. Thanks so much for your time. This is Nick Fershaw with MLSsoccer.com. Landon Donovan. Thank you.